on some of these letter things here, we're not doing it right. It's too gray. How much trouble is it to get that change to some other color? Just find the right place in the program, make the appropriate change, and we'll run the whole thing again. Let's make uh, bug A go, uh, what would you say, down one square and right one square. So you see what we'll get th is the program going through these lines. A consulting graphic artist and a Bell Laboratory scientist are collaborating on an idea for an experimental computer-made movie. That come out of it, you okay. know, and, and right, yes, this idea yes, of you yes. being able to, to program something so we know what it's supposed to do. And what I get a great deal of response out of is you don't know what it's exactly going to do in terms of images. In it's great interesting great. to me that, that you say the unexpected things that happen. Yeah. Because in, in a sense, the computer has done exactly what you told it to do, right? Their shooting script is an intricate set of instructions written in one of several programming languages available. This one is B-Flix, short for Bell Labs Flix. This is an excerpt from a B-Flix computer movie showing how the script, now a deck of punch cards with all the cues typed in, is fed into the computer, winding up as a reel of recorded tape. Hey, Bernie? Yes, sir. I've got another Beatflix movie here on two reels. Can you possibly do it now? Sure can. Great. No that's, that's the second half. All right. And uh, this is the first one. All right. Fine. We'll run it right now. How do you want these run, Ken? Uh, please run it just halfway between F5.6 and F8. Leave it perfectly in focus. Under computer control now, the taped information is converted into rapidly moving pictures made up of a fine mosaic of points of varying light intensity. A synchronized movie camera automatically photographs the fast moving images as they are plotted and drawn on the face of a cathode ray tube. out to this technology. I want to incorporate this technology into, into my art and, and have the two mixed together. And for instance, what spellbinds me as an idea is that I'll be able to sit someplace in a railroad station and uh, write a movie, or maybe even pick up a telephone eventually and write a movie.